Every diabetic should wear office numbers. The most important number, as per the current standards, are HB1 AC. At least every diabetic should get its HB1 AC level voice and just keep it around 6.5 in every in any case less than seven, less than seven. And as far as the blood sugar being is concerned, fasting blood sugar normal levels. Say 70 to 110. In any case, less than 130. Your PP blood sugar take around one and a half to two hours after the meal. They should not exceed 160 in any case. Your keep your BP regularly checked and maintain it just below 140 or 90, preferably around 130 and 82 or 84. Check your cholesterol levels thoroughly. Your total cholesterol levels should be less than 200, LDL levels should be less than 100, triglycerides should be less than 140, HDL is a good cholesterol and it should be above 50. So, all, know, know your numbers regularly. Regular exercise is an important lifestyle modification in control of diabetes besides diet control. The regular exercise helps in maintaining our ideal body weight, maintaining our sugar levels, maintaining our blood pressure, maintaining our cholesterol levels and a good bone health. The type of exercise which we can perform are we can do a swimming exercise, we can do a cycling, we can do jogging and even brisk walking. You can also involve some balancing exercises, resistance, resistance exercises and yoga. Any type of exercise you involve and if you do it for 30 minutes, 5 days a week will help to control all that. Your diabetes, your blood pressure, your cholesterol levels, attaining a proper and ideal body weight and preventing cardiovascular complications. So motivate yourself, motivate your colleagues. Motivate your neighbors and contribute to Fit India and Tandras Punjab. Diabetes is spreading almost one in every fourth person in the urban areas and spreading its things in the rural population also. We can't affect our genetics, we can't affect the family history, but we can modify, delay or prevent the diabetes by some lifestyle modifications which includes diet control, a regular disciplined life, a regular exercise, self-monitoring of blood pressure and taking regular medicines if required. If the long term, it is a long term diabetes and uncontrolled diabetes which can precipitate certain complications which can involve eyes, kidneys, nerves and even heart. So these lifestyle modifications, they do not prevent, they also prevent the delay in the onset of diabetes but also the onset of these complications also. So control your diabetes very well by the drugs, by self-monitoring of blood glucose and the regular lifestyle modifications.